it going guys, Sharblox here. In this video, I will be showing you guys how to get the How To Program Basic book in the Ready Player 2 event over on Roblox. Now, somebody discovered how to get this. One of my friends actually sent me all the steps on Discord. So we will be going through that in this video. It's kind of easy to get, it just takes a while. And the game you need to play to actually get this on your account is called Bee Swarm Simulator. I'm sure most of you watching this video have probably seen this game before. It's very popular. I'm not a massive fan of it, not gonna lie just because I'm kind of lazy when it comes to these simulators. I honestly just can't be bothered to play them. But in this video, we're going to be playing it so I can get this book on my account. So what we're going to do, let's go ahead, let's jump into the game and I will show you guys all the steps to actually get this book. Okay, so once you're inside of the game, the first thing you want to do is just go ahead and click on the settings option at the top and we actually need to enter some promo codes. Now, I've actually already got all of these promo codes. I'm just gonna leave them on the screen right here. There's actually seven of them and all you have to do is just type these in. Now for me, I'm just gonna copy and paste them because it's gonna be so much easier. But if you just do these in order, you should actually get all of the stuff you need. So we're just gonna copy in the second one. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna leave the codes in the um, comment section and in the description as well. Oh, Carmen San Diego, that's interesting. I have to check out that event later as well. Um, but like I said, I'll leave all of these comments and stuff um, in the description just in case you guys need to copy and paste them and um, then it's gonna be a lot easier so like I said literally copy and paste each one you can do the whole thing in a few seconds and once all of these are copied and pasted in I will show you guys what to do next so there you go now we're on number seven which is troggles redeem there you go we have got all of the codes now once you've redeemed all of the codes just go off the system settings and we actually want to run over here and we want to go to the shop now don't worry if you've never played this game before to be honest I haven't played it either to be honest like all of my stuff's a bit rubbish we're just going to press e to open up the shop we need to scroll all the way along and we need to get to these goggles i think they're called yeah these right here we need to get the strange goggles now we actually need to get all the equipment to get these it looks like we've got the cogs from entering the codes but one thing we need to get is the micro converter so we're just going to run up the um, platform and the micro converter should be there so there you go that's it and there's this like screen which kind of looks a little bit like the goggles so what we're going to do we're going to go and collect this thing there you go we've got the micro converters now we're going to run back to the shop and we will actually be able to buy these goggles. If you've never played this game, what you do is you just drag out your egg, do yes, then you do okay, I've got a new bee, now let's just make some honey. We have to get 77 honey, that's actually so annoying, now I'm going to have to be waiting ages. Um, but once you get 77 honey, okay, okay, we've got 120, it didn't take too long. Um, and that was annoying. Like I said, I haven't really played this game. I don't exactly know how to play it. I'm literally just showing you guys the steps I've got on how to um, get the hat because that's all I care about. So let's skip over. We're going to go back to the goggles. There you go. We can craft item. We've got it equipped. In. Let's leave the shop. And as you can see, we're now wearing it on our Roblox character. All right, guys. So now what we've got to do is make our way back over to this computer. But this time, guys, the computer screen is open. And what you want to do is run over and press E to look inside the computer. Now, what this B is going to do is actually give us some different symbols. Now, these might be different for everyone watching this video. So as you can see, I've got that colon. Then I've got a start question mark okay so if you stay here it will actually play again so if you press e to like have a look again and you maybe you missed a bit you will actually be able to see it again all right so to help me what i actually did was bring out a notepad and then it's that thing question mark okay so i think i've got it this is pretty much my code i typed it out on a notepad just so it was a little bit easier for me Okay, so now what we've got to do is we've actually got to run over to the pollen field and apparently we've got to click parts and this is going to be glitching, right? So our first one was that like colon thing. I don't even know what, it, what that thing's called, but we're just going to enter it. Then we click for our second one, which was a star. So where is our little star? There you go. Then we click for our third one, which was our little dash thing. We can always bring up our um, notepad if we're a bit confused. And then the last one we've got is our question mark. So there you go. That should be it. Now it's got all smiley faces we did it successfully and we've got to collect all of this honey and these icons i don't even know what they are but just collect all of them and um, which will spawn in the middle of this field okay guys so what we're going to do next is we're going to go back to the computer and again you want to write down the code it gives you this time it should only be three of them i believe and i believe again it's different for everyone which is currently playing the game but let's run over let's go ahead let's press e let's see what it gives us so we have got what is it going to be um wait what i didn't get that i thought it was supposed to be something did it just show them all at the same time 
Okay, so now the bee appears to have gone. So maybe it's a bit different from what I thought. You guys can follow along with me. I think we have to go ahead and find the bee because I definitely didn't see a code there. So I think we have to go, oh, there it is. Okay, so we've got to run up to the bee here. It might be here or in the mushroom part or somewhere else. Okay, it just disappeared. Why did it just disappear? Maybe it's gone somewhere else. Maybe it's gone to the mushroom part. Okay, so I can kind of see it and it is actually giving me a code. So first of all, we've got that bracket thing. Then we had the star, then we had the and sign. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to type that down. We had the bracket, then we had the and, um, then we had the star sign, I believe. Was that even in the right order? Okay, so I worked out how to do it. I went to the sunflower field and we're going to put in the first one, which was the bracket, I believe. So there you go, that was this one. So in the second field, um, if I'm doing it correctly, it should be the and sign. Obviously, if I'm doing it wrong, I will tell you guys. Or also make sure your pollen bag is empty and you've just got to look for it so okay that was easy we found it now we've got to do the and sign which is this one and then on the last field it should be the star if we did it correctly i'm really hoping so yeah that's the order it seems to do it in i'm really hoping we got it right um obviously if not i just have to do it again and i'll let you guys know um this event is very annoying i can see a lot of kids getting frustrated with this fairly quickly um but now we've got to find the star so what we're going to do we're just going to click on a few parts try and find it without getting eaten by giant bugs where even is it wait what oh there it is so star please say we got that right they will actually turn into these um smiley faces just quickly and then it goes away i almost missed the recording on that that was annoying um so they will all turn into smiley faces um you'll know once you get it right because they will disappear and then what you need to do is head over back to the computer i think it was originally the other way around because i changed this one to an and sign i changed this one to the star and this one to the bracket and then it worked um so yeah it's a bit i don't know all of these kind of like ready player two i'll be battles events they're kind of a bit glitchy i don't know if that's just me but um I'm just going to harvest some of this pollen so I can fill up my bag more and then I'll run over back to the computer. Okay, so making our way back over to the computer, what we have to do is gain another code, but this time it's going to be actually letters. It's not going to be these weird symbols. So we're going to press E, we're going to wait for the B and we're going to see what it is. So let's see what mine is. Um, M, C, D, S. Okay, so you can write that down so you don't forget it. So mine was M C D S. If you want to write it down, go ahead. That stands for meadow, clover, um, something, sunflower. Um, I don't know the names of these flowers. But what we're going to do, we're actually going to go over to the fields. And if we enter in these codes, if we actually like, go to the first field, I think the first one was meadow, right? So M for meadow. Um, but there is actually codes in each field. I will show you guys how to do it as I'm doing it. Like I said, this game is a bit confusing. I guess this bit's the meadow. So what we need to do is we actually need to look for the symbol hidden somewhere in here if you just click on the ground we should be able to find it okay so here you go so this one is a bracket and what you have to do then is go over here and we basically have to enter in the code on this field so the first one would be a bracket because it's m for meadow if you guys see what i mean so we'd go to the question mark and then we'll change this to a bracket just like that okay hopefully this explains it so m was that funny bracket thing so i put it here clover was question mark um dandelion was bracket and then s that's for sunflower that's going to be something else so what we're going to do we're going to run over to the sunflower section and what we have to do is basically dig it up see what it is i hope we're close to winning it because um, i'm getting kind of fed up so there you go it's actually the star so we're going to enter the star and now we need to go ahead and enter that i'm um, on the other field over there like i said this is the first time i'm playing this so i'm kind of like making the video where where I don't really know what's going on. I've just got like a few instructions, if you know what I mean. So I'm still trying to figure stuff out. Um, but we're going to run over here and then we're going to put in the combination. So the first one was M for us. So we do need to change this. I didn't get it right. So M was this thing. Um, if that bug can get out of the way. There you go. And then the next one was in fact a question mark. So there you go. We've got that right. Then the next one would be um, a bracket thing. So we've got one of those brackets right there. And then the last one was a star. So we're going to change this to a star. And then where is it? Come on, please work. Yay, we got it right. Smiley faces. Okay, so that is one of the other steps. Once you've got all those, you want to collect this thing in the middle and also collect all of these tickets. I don't, want, I don't know what they are, but just collect them anyway. 
Okay guys, so now we've got to make our way back to the book. And if you got all of these codes correct, we should be able to get a prize. I hope I explained this easy because um, it was kind of like frustrating for me to do. I'm not, I don't know why. I don't know why this event was so like frustrating, but hopefully we've got a book. So if we run up to the robot, what we actually have to do is press E on our keyboard once more and please change into the book. I just want to unlock this book now. I'm fed up of doing this event. Please just give me the prize. Yay, we got it. Wait, how do we actually get it? Oh, okay, I think we've got it. Do we actually have to run in here and get it? I don't know. You might have to. Um... No, maybe it's all right. We're going to now check out our inventory and hopefully we've actually got the Burke. And there we go, guys. I to moan that that is how you do it. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to leave like and subscribe and I will see you guys in the next one.